Give rest, O Christ, to your servants with your saints, where sorrow and pain are no more, neither sign but life everlasting. You only are immortal, the creator and maker of all, and we are mortal, formed of the earth, and to earth shall we return. For so did you ordain when you created me, saying, You are dust, and to dust you shall return. All of us go down to the dust, Yet even at the grave, we make our song. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Give rest, O Christ, to your servants with your saints, where sorrow and pain are no more, neither sign but life everlasting. Into your hands, O most merciful Savior, we commend your servant Brad. Acknowledge, we pray, a sheep of your own fold, a lamb of your own flock, a sinner of your own redeeming, a beloved. Receive him into the arms of your mercy, into the blessed rest of everlasting peace, and into the glorious company of the saints in light. Amen. Now we are going to be going up to Maple Grove Cemetery, and we're going to be led up today singing when the saints go marching in. <laughs> O God, whose days are without end and whose mercies cannot be numbered, make us, we pray, deeply awareness of the shortness and uncertainty of human life. And let your Holy Spirit lead us in holiness and righteousness all our days, that when we shall have served you in our generation, we may be gathered to our ancestors, having the testimony of a good conscience, in the communion of the Church, in the confidence of a certain fate, and in the comfort of a religious and holy hope in favor with you, our God, and in perfect charity with all. We ask this through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. God of grace and glory, we thank you for Brad, who was so near and dear to us and who now has died. We thank you for the friendship that he gave and for the strength and the peace that he brought. We thank you for the love that he offered and received while he was with us here on earth. We pray that nothing good in this man's life will be lost but will be of a benefit to the world and all that was important to him will be respected by those who follow and that everything in which he was great will continue to mean much to us now that he has died. Mm -hmm. We ask you Lord that he may go on living in his children, in his grandchildren, in his family, in his friends, in their hearts and minds, in their courage and their consciousness. And also that we do not brood over it so that it overwhelms us or isolates us from others. May God grant <coughs> us courage and confidence in the new life of Christ. We ask this in the name of the risen Lord. Amen. Okay. Okay. 